everyone, this is Randy with AGM. Today we're going to be talking about our new Neath Digital Night Vision Optic. So in this video we're going to be going over some of the common features that this shares with some of our other products and we're going to talk about what sets it apart, what makes it different as well. To start off, what separates the Neath from our thermal optics and our night vision optics is that essentially this is a digital night vision optic. Now, we'll get into that. It does have a day mode, so you can actually see and use it during the day, which is a pretty good feature that this comes with, but essentially this is digital night vision. So for a lot of people that might not understand the primary differences, there's thermal, which is basically, without getting into the science, it's basically heat detection, and then there's traditional analog night vision. So similar to this device I have here, and we'll do more videos about these later, but this is these, these are some of our NVGs. This is what we refer to as analog night vision. So the night vision is basically happening in real time with the technology going through the tube here, the intensifier tube, and that is a very different and albeit a lot more expensive kind of technology, but it is strictly for seeing at night and not detecting heat. So unlike thermal optics, when you're looking at just heat detection, when you're looking through a night vision device, you're amplifying the visible light that you already have available to you, but you can also see light in the infrared spectrum that you cannot see with your naked eye and thermal can't pick up any of that. So what that means is that sometimes if it's really, really dark, even analog night vision will struggle to be really useful. You will need some, at least a small amount of either visible ambient light or some kind of illuminator. And the same is true with digital night vision. So without getting into the primary differences between analog and digital night vision, in this video we're gonna keep it simple and just talk about the Neath. This is essentially our first digital night vision optic that we're offering the market, and it brings a lot of exciting features at a really competitive price point, and I think you guys are gonna like it. So if you're not too familiar with what digital night vision is, the best frame of reference I could probably give you is think about your security system that you might have on your house or that you may have seen. So it's a camera system, System, but then when it gets dark, you'll see that switch to a black and white system. And now that camera has a sensor that is strong enough to basically amplify what visible light is there. And a lot of camera systems will actually put out a tiny amount of infrared light to help illuminate the area so that the sensor can pick up the information and then relay that information on the screen for you. So for the Neath specifically, think of the device as essentially a camera. It contains a sensor inside. Unlike our thermal devices, this sensor, a digital sensor, is picking up visible light. This will give you a full color uh, display during the daytime, and then it will either automatically switch to black and white when the light becomes low enough, or with a press of a button, you can toggle it and switch it to night mode. Of course, when you pick up the Neath, it does come with the Trident 2 uh, American Defense Manufacturing QD mount here. So you're gonna be able to just pick this up, slap it onto your rifle, and using it is gonna be very similar to using a regular thermal scope. So you're gonna put this on your gun, you're gonna zero it in the same fashion. The menu and how you go through all the different modes are gonna differ a little bit because we're talking about digital night vision versus thermal, so some of those, some of the features in the menu aren't going to obviously line up, but as far as zeroing and reticles, you're still going to have reticle choices. It still does onboard video and audio. It still records for you and, and does very much of the same things that you're used to doing with the thermal scope. It'll also connect to our AGM Connect app, which makes using it very easy. When you open the box of the Neath, it will come with basically everything you need to go. It'll come with a charger as well as two 18650 batteries, obviously the cable and a lens cloth. Pretty much everything else that you need is in there. The manual instructions on how to use the Neath, all ready to go so that it is a plug and play solution for you. So of course it still comes with the USB connectivity port right here on the side, serves two purposes. You can plug in the cord, plug it into your computer and offload any videos or any pictures that you might have taken through the device and it doubles as a charging port. So if you have an external battery pack that you're running on your gun and you wanna plug it into the device and let it, let it run all night long, you have that capability as well. You'll also notice on the front here of the Neath, instead of having the laser range finder, this is a small infrared light. This is a 850 nanometer light. So for you guys that are familiar with like night vision and, and looking at 950 versus 850 lights, 850 just 
basically is a little bit brighter. We went with 850 in this small little body because we wanted to throw out as much light as possible, but it is kind of nice that it comes with the unit and it is built into it right on top. You could also focus the beam by turning this dial a little bit, and that light will help you, if you're in total darkness, will help you see out to about, oh, 50 to 75 yards pretty easily. You'll be able to pick up eye shine on various animals much further with even just the small infrared light right here. Now you still have the focus knob up front just like a thermal scope. So depending on what you're looking at and how far it is to get it in focus, you just turn that knob and you're good to go. One thing on a lot of people's mind when they're considering something like this is essentially its performance. And that's quite honestly going to depend on lighting conditions. Being that it is a digital night vision optic, if you're going out at night and the night happens to be clear skies with a full moon, you're going to see really far, really well. However, if you go out at night and you're far away from the city lights and you're out in the middle of nowhere and it's dark and it's just starlight or cloud cover and there's no moon at all, you're gonna definitely need the infrared illuminator and you might want to pick up a different IR illuminator. One like this, this is our Sue. You can buy these on our website, but there's plenty of other IR illuminators out there as well that will give you much more throw and distance. Now the sensors are improving and with any digital night vision device, it's just gonna keep getting better as time goes on. As it stands right now though, you're kind of limited to using infrared light. If you're just trying to rely on the visible light that's already out there, if it's a really dark night, you're gonna want to pick up an infrared light as well. So if you look at how I've got the Neath set up on this gun specifically right now, um, just for no reason, this was just the gun that we had. I mean, this isn't really something I would probably call like a go-to hunting rifle, but it's something that I had available so that I could show you. This right here is just an infrared light, right? And this is an infrared laser. So with the Neath, this is actually a really nice combination because I could just toggle the light on and off and that will give me much more range with the digital night vision. Toggling between day mode or night mode is as simple as pressing and holding the center button if you tap the button, you get your picture in a picture display at the top, just like many of you are familiar with using with thermal optics. If you tap the, uh, the button right here in the middle of the dial, that will begin your recording. So your audio recording will start or your video recording will start right then. And if you rotate the dial, you will be zooming in and out. You're still digitally zooming. This is a digital night vision optic, but you are still digitally zooming just like you do with thermal. So keep that in mind. As you zoom in, your picture quality will deteriorate. Why you might want to be picking up a digital night vision scope is obviously going to be a personal choice, but there are two primary reasons. Well, a couple primary reasons that you might be considering one of these. These are very affordable for someone who's wanting to get into night hunting without breaking the bank. So a lot of guys will start doing research and you'll learn quickly that thermal optics, night vision, especially the analog stuff, it's very expensive. Well, if you're someone who wants to give it a try and you want pretty good capability out to, maybe out to two, 300 yards, as far as detection, being able to see animals, take shots, and start enjoying night hunting, the Neath is a fantastic choice for you. Another reason you might wanna pick up the Neath is as a buddy scope. So just like many hobbies, right? If you get into thermal or night vision, you get into hunting, right? And you, let's say you save up some money, you spend a couple thousand bucks and you get the gun and all the gear and you do it, you'll learn quickly, it kinda of sucks to do it alone. So just like a lot of other hobbies and things that we enjoy, it's a lot more fun to bring a buddy. The idea being that I don't wanna go out alone because that's not as fun as bringing my, my friend, my brother, my dad, my neighbor, whatever. So if you want to get your buddy something without breaking your bank and let him come out and enjoy even thermal hunting or any kind of night hunting that you're doing, the Neath is a fantastic option for that because you're not gonna spend a ton of money. And by providing this or, or setting up a different gun, with digital night vision, you now have someone who can come along with you and enjoy night hunting, and, and they're gonna have a great time with this. It's a very capable optic, and you're gonna be able to shoot hogs and coyotes and other things very easily with this at a pretty dang affordable price. So that is the Neath Digital Night Vision Optic. Of course, if you have any questions about that, let us know in the comments, reach out to us. We'll see you next time.